All right. Who was it? I know it was someone. Someone came into my house this past week and took all my thoughts and inspiration. And I know it wasn't me. I know I didn't lose it. I, I've looked everywhere. I looked everywhere in my room. My room's not that big and I don't have too much stuff, so it's not hiding in my room anywhere. I even checked in my bathroom too, in the bathroom closet underneath all the towels. Nothing. No thoughts there. No inspiration there either. And I know it was sometime this past week because last week, like the week before this past week, I had a lot of thoughts. They were going around in my brain and I had them. And this week I don't have them. Well, this past week I didn't have them. So, and they're not anywhere in my house, so I don't know. Someone's gotta have taken them, I think. And hey, I mean, I know thoughts are hard to come by these days, so times are tough. You know, in this economy, you can only have as many thoughts and inspiration as you can get, so I don't know. I guess it makes sense to just kind of grab them from someone else, but I'd really like them back. I'd like to be able to think and, and come up with new ideas. I'd, I'd like to be able to do that again. I miss, I miss doing it. So I don't know, if, if, if you've seen them, if you've seen my thoughts, or if you've heard them, or if you've had, had them, uh, please return them. I would really, really appreciate it. Um, you don't have to. I know, I understand if you don't want to. It's kind of like that shopping cart dilemma thing where it's like the moral, great moral compass thing where, you know, you don't, you're not going to get in trouble if you don't, but you should do it because it's the right thing. So I guess it's like that. You don't have to return my thoughts if you find them, but if you do, I'd really appreciate it. Oh, well, I, I guess this is one. Maybe they're, maybe they're coming back.